not too long, not too long. We're in the beautiful, we're in Canada, man. We're back in Canada once again, y'all. You know what I mean? Just got here, another competition, another season. It's kind of cold out. Wish I would have had my scully, but we're going to make it do what it do. But welcome back to Canada, man. It's been a year. Wife is not competing this year, but we are here to support the rest of the R3 family and the team that is competing. So shout out to them. You can see what's going on behind us. We just parked, man. We'll see what the guy that offered today, man. But once again, so nice here in Canada. It's calm, clean. We're in Toronto today. You know, last last time we were here, we weren't in Toronto. This particular competition, we're here. We're gonna see what it's hitting on. We're gonna see what's going on. Yeah. Didn't know we were sneaking in a quick workout. Toronto was booming with buildings. First time being here, last time we were here, we didn't get a chance to make it. There's a lot going on. I know it's cold. I'm excited to be in Toronto. Hmm. Look at this stuff behind. <laughs> Wherever you want to try to venture and see. I know it's, it don't matter where we go, it's going to be cold. It's cold. It's November. It's supposed to be cold. You know what I'm saying? Excuse me. Okay. Check their little mailbox out, y'all. All right, all right. You on vacation or you, you away handling business? You at the uh, Marriott? You know, that's that. I don't know what this is. Sportsnet Grill. You know, guess it's a little... Real restaurant in that joint. Yeah, I know we next to where the Toronto Blue Jays play at. So hold this tea, baby. We might want to sip a little bit. We'll keep warm. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it out. You know, it's a little sweet. Not as sweet as you, though. <laughs> oh man! So once again, first time in the actual, I guess, this is the city of Toronto little hazy day or whatever um i mean it looks like it's a lot going on ain't too crowded as you can see the people i mean the temperature might have something to do with that on top of being cold it is saturday people probably laid back it is a uh, holiday weekend so that's what's going on there right now this is where we are right here sitter bang you're showing your little radius little little areas or whatever was around here clarence square Rogers Center, Center, you know what I mean? The CN Tower, you know? I'm trying to find out where that joint is now so I can show you all that. Oh, this is right behind me. Okay, cool. So to me, it seems like this is more the town here, right? Versus, I mean, I don't know what's around that corner. You want to take you want to see why we up I, the hill? I don't know about the CN Tower. I'm not talking about anything else. What I'm about it? Which way that we should be going to get to it? I don't know, let me see. Yeah, we're trying to see that joint's so big, man. We can't even figure out which way to get to this tower. But you know what? It's all good. Got an hour some change to kill. My only thing about trying to get to that place from here is it looks like, all right, we, maybe we go down. And then it's on the street behind it. I don't know. We don't know. At least y'all can be somewhere warm to find out. We're going to brave the elements that it's cold. So we can see if we can see it's around the corner or not. My wife ain't really beat for the cold, y'all, so <laughs> she just out here. <laughs> Got the hood on tight. <laughs> she ain't playing. Right. What I'm hoping is, is that we going the right way, because y'all see them stairs behind me? One way or the other, we got to go back up. I mean, hey, who knew that we was going to be right next to where the Toronto Blue Jays play? I mean, hey, that's kind of cool, right? That's real cool. Right now, we still trying to figure out how do we get inside of that CNN, see, not CNN, my bad, too many ends, CN Tower. Trying to see. Was she better than the GPS? 
that's it. Before we had the GPS, this is how we did it anyway. We can see the building, it's right there. It got to be a route around there, some kind of way to get to it. There she go. Right in front. Need to find a spot that sells Scully's rent. Think they call them Scully's in Canada Bay? <laughs> or maybe Schoolies. Or something, I don't know. I don't know, I'm not gonna pretend. You know what I'm saying? I know where we're from. We can go into the regular corner store or maybe the hair place. You know what I'm saying? If you just need a quick scout. You know, I got a bunch of them at the crib. I ain't got nobody to blame but myself being too cool. You know, thank you to my wife. My wife packed the vehicle this time. I think that was awesome. I think if I would have thought about it and remembered it, I probably would have. Okay. Yeah. Update. Scully and scarf. Yeah. Yeah. And it's daytime, so you know. Ooh. Ooh, you know it's gonna get crazy. Look at my man. My man whipping that joint. Whip, whip the cement truck rent. Whip it. <laughs> Shit, it's cold out here. I can't let this cement get rocked up and locked up in this joint. Okay, who we got right here? All right, all right, all right, all right. Let me bring y'all into what's going on, okay? Okay, Edward S. Ted Rogers, okay? Wow, right, gotta find out what was, you know, the best is yet to come. All right, got it. Here we go, here we go. He is the founder, president, and CEO of Rogers Communications, okay? All right. Oh, wait, we held it down for 48 years. All right. So I had to catch this joint right here, y'all. Look at this turtle. This is awesome, man. You know what I'm saying? I was like, I thought it was like a little bush or something like that. I get a little closer. I'm like, boy, they, they know how to do it up here in the aquarium. What's going on over here? Okay, Ripley's Aquarium of Canada. All right. Let's see what's going on. $5 off after 5 p.m. Sharks after dark. Sharks after dark. You know, at this point, I think my wife just, like, let's just see what something inside going to hit on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Let's go find out what's going on. All right, you Okay. Crap. Huh? I think I saw like $44. Well, yeah. they, 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 they probably pushed the price up because it's cold outside. Yeah, that's right. If you cannot. Check this out. Spread the meat. Latour CN Tower. Guest entrance is this way. Kiosk. Bon Appetit, okay, so, I don't know, I guess this is something that you can eat that's generally open for them. They got tickets and billets over there, so I'm wondering if the tower is a place where it shows and stuff like that. See the elevator thing going all the way up? So it's more, let them know what it is, babe, so that way just like if somebody's watching this, it's, what did you say you just told me? It's just saying, going up the elevator thing, or some people walk up, I guess, and you just going to look over the city room. Okay. All right, well, y'all can see this right here. Let me show y'all this sign over here. Check this joint out right here. See what I'm saying? She said she can't wait to do that. Okay. We will see. A uh, quick update on what happened with or why you didn't see the actual, um, what do they call it, the aquarium. $44 per adult, just in case you're wondering, at the uh, Ripley's Canadian Aquarium. Um, that's before tax. I think after tax, it's like 49. It's a change that is Canadian. I forget what the conversion is in U.S. because you know it does vary depending on the time. But we elected to keep it moving a little bit as opposed to just paying to go into that. You know, why not move around and see a little bit more of it? So that's what happened with that whole situation with that. Now we're trying to see what's going on in here and what is it called. Cool. This thing is serious, too, so we'll see right in here. This thing is serious. All right. What do you want to do, yo? 
You want one yogurt? Okay, cool. Okay. Today is November the 11th. So in Canada, they recognize Remembrance Day. You know, as we have, you know, I mean, Veterans Day, that's what they recognize, you know, to honor, you know, and, uh, you know, acknowledge the memory of their, their veterans and their different people and, you know, have, have created or have given, you know, a lot of themselves as we celebrate in the U.S. as well for our veterans. So, you know, it's a lot going on, people moving around. They did a moment of silence earlier. Um, but yeah, that's what it called, it's called in uh, Canada, Remembrance Day, and it's actually the day after, you know, our Veterans Day. So, wonderful thing, wonderful thing. Oh wow, look at that up there. I guess that's a blue jay up there. Well, that's kind of neat right there on that pole. I don't know if you guys can kind of see it off here. Right around in here, it's a black blue jay. <laughs> I think that's pretty awesome. Let me see if I can zoom in on it for you guys a little bit. But right in there. Oh, that's neat. The Scotia Bank Arena. You know what I'm saying? Home of obviously the Toronto Raptors. So this looks like definitely a downtown area where a lot of this must be a lot of where the food is. As you can see over here, Starbucks, obviously, regular places, you know, I guess that's Hoops over there, and we got, that's the Sports Bar Subway, Peter Grill back there behind us is the Rogers Center, you know, there's a lot of different things that's here. You definitely got to visit if you come to Canada, you definitely got to pop in on Toronto, there's no question, that ain't, you know. You come in November, you better bring some gloves and a scarf and a scully, though. I know that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and as y'all can see, your boy finally found a store that had a scully in it. Mm hmm. I ain't gonna be playing with him out here. Nose act like he wanted to start running. Too grown, man. Too grown to be playing them kind of games, baby. Went on ahead and found me a scully. It's back around behind me, y'all. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this, would you look at this? <laughs> it's dope, man, it's dope. I'm trying to see where we gonna grab some grub at, man. I don't know, right now it's looking like, uh, it might be that joint back there we looked at. Some kind of uh, sports something. Well, they don't play no games. They see this camera, they be like, what's going on? Yeah. Oh yeah. See what we got, look at this. I don't know what you call them joints, man. But okay. Okay. Just hustling, man. I'm just trying to show you all some of what's down here. You know, downtown in Toronto, man. Piece of place, a lot of that. Uh, I smell that in the air. That's uh, it's definitely not pizza I'm smelling now. <laughs> you see the wife's face. Huh. Not too thrilled about that. Shout out to Christine giving us some of these ideas. Coach Pat too. Obviously the whole you know the whole R3. Coach Nell, you know. Since Coach Crystal, yeah. Told us get on out there, man. Check things out. We was told this is more like the equivalent of uh, like their Times Square. This particular block right here. Right here is uh, this King Street right here we on right now. We got the sushi bar jumping. Uh Hey Lucy, hey Lucy Cafe, right here. It's another piece of place. Craft cocktails, rooftop patio eatery. Probably really nice when the weather is cooperative. Look at this joint right here they got on this on this line. I don't know what you call it. I think we're gonna go across the street and see what's happening over here at the Luma. What you feeling? What you say? You think it's what? Well, that's a canteen. I don't know if that's separate. What's it? What's canteen? That's like a like you go oh no, we ain't, we ain't come all the way to can. We ain't come all the way to can. We're gonna buy your gonna buy a cafeteria. What's this right here? Let's get my say. If you can't pronounce it, you show sure shouldn't eat it. Right. What we got here? Cajun what? Cajun chicken sandwich with the lettuce. 
Yeah, and that's it. They got a chicken sandwich and the rest of it is drinks. Okay, can't go there. I had the J over here, my the J walk. You know what I'm saying? It's just right here. Okay. LA for nice. Am I saying it wrong, babe? Probably. <laughs> it don't matter to me. It should though. It should. You know, I don't disrespect people. You know what I say, boy, if you look in there and ain't nobody inside, might be an indication it might not be hitting. It's not open. Well, it's just not open yet, is what you're going with. Okay. Oh, she bugged. You too. <laughs> wow. Once we figure out exactly where we're going, I'll pull the cam back out because it's cold killing these batteries. Beautiful art. See a sign like this here, you like, oh yeah. So this looks nice. I don't know what this is. Check my man out, y'all. Check my man out. Talent. All right, y'all. So real quick, we settled on this spot. It's called um, the Paint House. You know what I'm saying? Sports bar. Looks like it's gonna be good. I think I'm gonna go for this Nashville hot chicken platter, but I don't want no Nashville hot sauce on it. You know me, I gotta get creative. Get them not put that on there and put some of this honey garlic on it. They can make that happen, brother will be happy. All right, y'all, so what I did was, I went with that thing I told you, man. I was gonna do that Nashville hot, hot chicken germ, but I told them to hold that hot and give me some honey garlic on it instead. It's already pretty good. They slammed that down. The wife got the works burger joint. Fries, big old onion ring and all of that. Yeah, yeah. Looks good. Tastes even better. All right, we got to dig in. Food was good. Food was good. Y'all seen it. Y'all ain't seen me tearing on it down, but it was good. My man's still out here, y'all. Wow. Look at that skyline over there. It's crazy. Where is it at? Right here. Oh, wow. Yo, check this out, y'all. Look at the tower. CN Tower. That joint all the way up here. It's crazy. Got my man again. There you go. Yes, sir, brother. Yes, sir. Do your thing. Oh, there you go. Yeah. My wife don't play no games, man. She said a dog running this way. I ain't even see the dog. She th she threw the briz eggs on, y'all. Oh man. On our way, baby. Ripley's. Heard they got ten feet sharks or something in here, man. You know. The waiter, man, at the uh, restaurant. Said he done been to this joint four times. Said he love coming here. Every time he come, it's something different, something new. So, you can already see what's going on now, but. See that thing, look, that's what it look like downtown Toronto, man, at night. As crazy as it's gonna sound, y'all don't actually seem like it's, it was colder earlier. Found out, though, the reason why that thing kicked up so strong like that, so cold down here, because we ain't too far from the, from the lake, the water, the, whatever it is. We ain't too far from it. So, that's what that is. God told, me, told us we came at the right time of the year. I said, you said it ain't cold yet. And I said, it ain't cold yet. He said, nah, it's gonna get a whole lot colder. So I'm glad we came now. Matter of fact, let's hear up and get inside this aquarium and show y'all what that thing looking like. All right, so we in here. Exactly. Uh, that experience begins at Canadian water. Wow. Yeah, we in this joint, baby. This joint right here. Hey, okay. you look like you ready for some flour, cornmeal. Mm-hmm. No, no, you're not. Aquarium. Aquarium. You good. You all right. Well protected, brother.
Oh, I was about to say, somebody in there. Look, look at little dude. Little old man in there. That's crazy. There you go. There you go. There you go. Long. Coming right over top of Peach. Coming right over top of my wife. All somebody need to do to yell out right now. I think I see a leak. Oh, whole night done. Everybody chillin'. They ain't gonna be beat for what come next. They ain't made a straw big enough to drink all this water. Right. Right. Put my fish behind me, baby. Uh, I'm a fish tank, you know? Yeah. Oh, look, coming over top of the show. Oh, I'm not doing it. See that? See that? Wow. Had to get out of here. The wife said she was getting nervous being in that joint. That's hot right there. Uh, big cousin right behind me. It's creeping, it's creeping on me the whole time. What's this about right here? Well, that's the emergency stop button. I thought that was like, hold up, you know. I thought that meant something else, y'all. This spot you can get some yogurt, Ripley's Cafe, gallery joint. They got some of everything going on here. You know? I mean, I don't know. I don't know, it's something about the nighttime in Canada, man. It's, it's, it's warmer. It's warm. We're in the same place we was. So right now the conversion was smooth, man. You know what I mean? Full price, $44.99 before tax, $49.99. Canadian money before um before five. So what we did was is went on ahead, bust the move, went had dinner, came back. You can actually buy your tickets online, right? Um, and it's five dollars less per person. So we did that, which brought it down to forty ninety nine. Then you got to remember with the conversion. So all in for two tickets, we spent roughly around sixty three dollars and like thirty something cents. Definitely something to think about when you come. Look around and see what you can kind of deals you can get, but not a bad experience. Honestly speaking, I'm I'm glad we kind of waited, saved a few bucks because it was okay. You enjoy yourself. I think the wife was getting a little bit of, like the shape of the glass or something was throwing her off, you know, equilibrium, and she wasn't feeling the greatest in there, so we got on the out of there. But it was cool. You know, one of the greatest things about when you're in Canada, obviously, is that, it, you know, that, that exchange, or not exchange, but when it changes over, the value of the money being different. So it's funny because even when you use, like, just to say whatever cards that you use, um, when you look at it actually online and, we, and you review it, it actually already shows you what it actually cost you in U.S. So I think that's pretty cool, you know. Just when we got ready to go in there, we came out of there, we was getting a picture. One of the pictures that you take when you first come in there, I think it was like $27.99 Canadian. Um, and then when it went up to, uh, with the tax and everything, it was like $31 and some change. $31.99, and we wind up getting it, honestly, when you look at the... Uh, the change in Canadian from Canadian to uh, US, it was uh, $22 and some change. So it was perfect. Ah, all right, family. So the rest of the evening, we pretty much just, you know, kept the camera off and just took our time and enjoyed the rest of the night while we were there in Toronto. Listen, if you ever get a chance and you're in the Canada area and you can make it to Toronto, please check it out. Great eats, great sights, beautiful city. You will not be disappointed. Like I said, man. Take advantage of these opportunities while you have them. Visit these places that you've heard about or maybe some of these places that you just really wanted to see different things. We didn't get a chance to check out the CN Tower, so we really now have an excuse to make sure that we go back. And actually, we're looking forward to it when the weather breaks. Listen, if you watched the video to this point, please do us a favor and smash the like button. It helps us getting this video out in the algorithm so that other people can see it on YouTube. As always, family, we appreciate the time. Thank you for tuning in, and we will see y'all on the next one. All right, family. Picks.